Hey everyone, it's James from uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. New England. So today I am doing the review of a aircraft that I finished back on March 18th of this year. It's the 148 scale Ravel B-17G Flying Fortress, which is in the markings of Chowhound. Now, a little bit of information about Chowhound. Uh, the first crew uh, put Pluto riding a bomb and a, bo and, and a bone in his mouth on it. But uh, the serial number for Chowhound was 4231. 367 and it was assigned to the 332nd squadron of the 91st bomb group um, it completed 30 missions with the first with the original crew the second crew chow hounds luck kind of ran out uh, it was shot down over germany august 8th of 1944 four of the crew were killed out of the nine that were on board that aircraft so that's a little bit of history about chow hound uh so this aircraft i had a little bit of fit issues with it not too much not too much fit issues but i mean i usually build my kits right out of the box i don't try to do any modifications unless it's changing up ordnance or anything uh or if there's some photo edge, I put some photo edge on it as well. But a lot of the kits that I do, I just build them right out of the boxes and I just, I detail them. I mostly, you know, dirty them up. Um, kind of make a, make it look like some uh, chipping, chipping of the paint and stuff. Uh, I did have one mishap on the front. Uh, for some reason, I clear coat, I went to clear coat it with a semi-gloss and it actually started to peel the original paint. So I had to do, but I kind of made do with that one a little bit, that little mishap a little bit. It actually worked out in my favor. It shows that I basically repainted where paint had peeled off. So it, it looked really nice when it got done. Uh, that's mostly it on the whole kit. I mean, it was a it was a good kit to build. Uh, I enjoyed building it. It's a big one. I'm hoping that I will keep going with big ones as well. Uh, I know I have currently. I built a FW uh, 200 from uh, the Condor from Trumpeter. You guys can actually, if you look really carefully in the photograph in the video, you can see it's right there in the video uh so but let's uh get to uh me uh doing a small video of spinning it on the turntable and show off some progress photos all right Yeah. 